the box light with the flat wing. Bigger prop, more oh, goes beautifully now. Flat wing works beautifully. How does it glide? Doesn't glide at all. Let's try the airfoil wing now. Tried to keep it almost exactly the same dimensions. It's actually about an inch shorter, I suppose. It's a Clark Z. It's flying very nicely. Engine off. And it does glide. There you go, there's the difference. Engine off. And it's glided, got a glide slope, but when it's uh, under power, it seems to be pretty much exactly the same. Maybe it does turn very well, though. Seems to have a tighter turn circle, maybe. There's no way I could glide in from out there before. I haven't got a motor brake on, unfortunately. That would be complicating matters. Flying around on half throttle now that I've got a bigger prop. That's much better. Let's try full bore. That's much better. I can actually glide it. Nice. Very nice. Now I have the flat edge facing forwards, so the leading edge is totally square. Still flying. Oh, it's a bit pitchy. Doesn't feel as good. It's a bit more up and down. Try the glide. And it's terrible. <laughs> That's a big difference. And we're back to the airfoil wing now. Yeah, it just it has more lift, flies smoother, takes less throttle to fly too. I reckon. It's yeah, it's much smoother. It's not up and down. It's not sort of uh, having many stalls or losing lift or anything like that so much. So although the flat wing works, airfoil wing works a lot better. easy to catch because it glides all the way into your hand too. What madness is this?
Thunderbird 1 to base. Every second counts. Stand by for Joe. Everything.